Do you ever get ridiculously excited when you see someone who looks like you in a movie? You know, that feeling when you're sitting in the theater and then, bam, someone walks on screen who has the same hair and skin tone as you. Do you know that feeling? Maybe if you're used to seeing people with your looks, it's not a big deal, but I'm not used to it. I love seeing multiracial families on screen. They overcome society's expectations and say to the world, hey, we're biracial and we're here too. It's empowering. Now, if only I could feel a little bit more of that ethnic empowerment in my daily life. I swear, it's like I'm illegitimate or something. Wait, what? Back up. We had to do that survey for the state test today in class, and it only let me select one option for ethnicity. One option. And? And I'm not one thing. I'm black and white. Why is that so hard for the world to understand? I don't know. What'd you end up putting? Well, I ended up asking Mrs. Simmons what I should put. She just looked at me and said, Well, are you really white? You should probably put black. Oh my God. I know. I'm so tired of people making comments like that about me. It's so frustrating. Well, I mean, I don't know, but I'm sure she didn't mean anything bad by it. Yeah, well, good intentions don't always have good impacts. Like microaggressions. What? Like the things people say that reflect an unconscious bias. Come on, we learned about it in English last year. Oh, yeah, I hate those. Like people's reactions when I tell them that I'm mixed. What do you mean? Your mom's white? You look so exotic. Are you adopted? <laughs> You're not black. Wait, seriously? It's exhausting. Well, don't worry about it too much. You are a beautiful, ethnically ambiguous woman, and I, for one, couldn't care less about your ethnic background. That doesn't make me feel any better. Oh, well, want a cookie? <laughs> a cookie is not gonna solve my problems. Of course not, but they do make you smile. Welcome everyone. Today we are here to discuss scholarships for black students. Why are you here? Because I'm black. Left. Right. Right. Left. Megan, stage left please. Okay, Claire, uh, please have a seat upstage. Upstage? What's upstage? The ensemble. Why the ensemble? I haven't even had a chance to audition yet. Because we're casting families. I can't cast you with them. Upstage, please. Um, actually, I'm both black and white. Can we just make a family that's both? No. It's easier this way. Go upstage. Um, up at the stage. No, I- Claire, it's not a big deal. It's just... theater, sweetheart. It doesn't matter what you are. It matters how you look. Go upstage. I'm not gonna do that. Right, that's, right, that's not fair. Okay, just, just give me a chance to read for it and then you'll see. And I mean, it's really not that hard. Just like get Megan to be the mom and, and, and Torrin can be the dad or Claire, something. Claire, we are not going to do that. It's confusing to an audience when a family doesn't look alike. I figured you of all people would understand. Claire, Claire, that was so messed up. I'm so sorry. What's her problem? Like, come on, this is not 1960. No one's gonna have a riot because you mix black with white. I, I get it, it's so messed up. You get it? How can you get it? You're white, you wouldn't understand. Actually, I'm half Japanese. And yeah, I look white, but I do get it. I'm sorry, I... It's okay, you're not the first. And it's kind of nice knowing that you get it. Yeah. Okay. 
Hi everyone, um, most of you guys know me. My name's Claire. I started this club because being mixed race is tough sometimes. It's like, people don't really get it. I mean, they say that race doesn't matter anymore, but it does. And it's often the little things that people say and do that make us feel so odd for not fitting into their racial categories. I want us all to remember that who we are and where we come from is something to love. What makes us stand out should be the things that we are most proud of. Together we can own up to the things that make us unique. We are biracial. And we are beautiful.